Hey everybody, welcome back to Shadow Tactics. This mission here is another special treat. Kind of like Sun Poo Castle was. This one is uh... 10 minutes might seem like very tight timing, but we're, go we're gonna try. We're gonna try. Now, the, uh, the speedrunner... He beats this in, uh, 52 seconds. <laughs> yep. Less than a minute due to extremely intelligent play. It's not really shenanigans. It's just extremely intelligent play. I'm going to try and just beat it in 10 because, you know, I'll fuck up. But we'll see how fast I can do this in. I was actually extremely wowed once again when I saw this one done. And then I thought to myself, yeah, I can, I can do that. 52 seconds? Nah, because I'm on controller. I need extra input steps <laughs> to switch between characters, but I can do that. So apparently, Takuma can shoot Kage with his rifle right off the bat. And I never realized that before. Okay, here we go, guys. Now I'm gonna do some things differently than how that guy did them. But basically, select Takuma. Oh, this is great if you want to do the don't choose Mugen achievement. But we're going to kill those two. I'm going to save because it's a good idea. Now, there's a location you can stand where you can hit Kage. But we can't just hit him yet. Uh, my dog might be barking for god knows why she does. Alright, hair pin. Jump down. Don't, don't, don't do this. That's a waste of time. That's a waste of time. Also, I should probably kill this guy. Now, I'm very slow at this, and... I didn't beat these dudes to the punch. They might actually see me while I'm here. Yeah, <laughs> I might have to restart. No, I, I just have to wait. Have to wait until they go. So to beat this 50 seconds, you need to beat those three to their post there. We want this dude's vision. Okay, save. Now, I'm gonna try and not get seen by that guy. It's a good thing I have 10 minutes to use, because perfecting this would be, ugh. Not something I want to do. It's not something I want to do at all. I might have to wait till that guy turns around, too. I'm, I'm... Okay. Uh, chat! Work, work. <laughs> She's excited because mommy's back home from her errand. So, yeah, she, she won't stop. Okay, uh, I can get around this dude. Never mind. I, I should just wait until he goes by. Those damn chickens will make it impossible. Damn chickens. So we're gonna we're going to climb up on the tower. Don't see me. <laughs> oh 
Alright, and then when you're up here, you want your gun selected. And you want to be able to jump down inside of the camp here. And we're gonna shoot... This guy. Come on, cutscene, come on, cutscene. Ah, oh, alright, you can't be seen. You just want to drag his body for a little bit, and then you win the game. <laughs> that's, that's how it works. So, I just can't be seen. I, I can't believe I didn't... I didn't freaking save up on the tower, but alright, whatever. Still got time. Still got time to kill. I highly recommend watching the real professional do this. Uh, I've got seven minutes. <laughs> we can we can fail all we want. Alright. Kaseka. Can't believe I didn't save when I got up here. Alright, so we don't want to be seen this time. Okay, I need to stay ducked there. Ooh, I need to stay ducked there. Also, those guys that are turned shouldn't be turned. But I can probably just throw my... Maybe I can shoot him instead. Okay, yeah, that one dude didn't turn this time. No, it can't be him. Everyone in the camp is still in the camp. Okay, don't shoot the innocent guy. You have to shoot the patrolling guard. It's a proximity thing. You know, it doesn't make sense, but... I'm gonna wait until that other dude's walking away. Let's try this out. Uh, no. That's not gonna work. <laughs> the guy made it look so easy. In fact, I think what he actually did was he shot the ground. I don't think he killed someone. But that's, like, really impossible to do with a controller. Unless you set... I don't know. I'm not sure how you would do it. Okay, we got it. <laughs> You should be able to do that without being seen or caught. There you go. You drag his body for a bit and it's like, oh, trap activated. Got you, silly fools. 52 seconds is how fast the dude did it. You do it flawlessly. Very short level. Very short. And that would unlock a lot of other things, too. If you want to go the extra mile, you can probably avoid stepping on loud surfaces doing that. You can probably you not select Mugen, you can not raise- well, you will raise an alarm, so you won't get that one. I guess you will oh, excuse me, I got the hiccups. You only get like three of the badges doing that. Okay, so that was easy. I thought that would be more difficult than it turned out being. 
now we have the real challenge. Mount Siru Prison. And once again, that'll be in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the failure. But hey, that's that's another one we beat <laughs> technically first try. Didn't have to restart. Alright, I'll, I'll bow out of here <laughs> with my unimpressive run. Thanks for watching, guys.